right guys so what you're looking at right here is a uh, brand new CH 18 horsepower S Kohler engine block um, it appears to have the original bores something broke on it probably the transmission or something eBay uh, was 80 bucks but with shipping it was like 125 bucks uh, because that's just how expensive these motors are nowadays I don't know why but you can see they left a few of the bolts on this plate and I'm assuming that that's because it's common that you don't want to take these off um, I don't know much about it because I've never really researched that but it's really easy to get these to leak and once they start leaking they just don't stop no matter what you do and uh, I'll show you that in a minute all right so here's the mower it's a hydrostatic uh, it's got the hydraulic deck lift pretty decent sized mower uh, you can see it's got crap all over it uh, it's leaking out of that cover like I said straight down everywhere and it's making a huge mess actually if I you can see just a puddle for me pulling it back here but just like from a quick look at that that's how much oily crap and then up under here that's what it looks like so yeah it's a mess I'm gonna need to wash it but right now I'm just taking the motor out it's really pain because the uh, front bolts are actually right in the way of this uh, sway bar so or the axle but yeah you just gotta stick a wrench up under there and then spend a lot of time taking them out but I'll get it out all right so I got all four nuts off and all two bolts because like I said this axle is in the way and since this is a hydrostatic it's got no translit release and it's just way too heavy to bring it over there and use that swing set engine hoist i got but i'm just going to go ahead and get the uh, normal engine hoist out and uh, lift this sucker up All right, so I got it out, and if I had to guess, I'd say it's probably about 110 pounds right now, which is uh, with the oil in it and everything. So, yeah, probably a little bit better on myself just to lift it out with the hoist, especially knowing that this shaft, drive shaft, can only go up so far, and then these bolts are in the way. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do another time lapse of me taking it down.